Okay, so welcome back. Here we have the A350 Asiana Airlines. Okay, so here we have the uh, model, the A350-900. Um, I really like this one. Like the, just a, I guess, simple sort of design. Um, first of all, we'll work on the front. Shaky. Um, so here we have the sort of cockpit, the mask, uh, Star, Alli Star Alliance, UN, the, um, I don't know how you read that, um, Asiana Airlines, door, uh, new back, we have the HL. Uh, the registration which is Hotel Lima 8078 and for doors, windows I can't uh, I think that's this aviation group Let's focus focus good camera focus focus okay we're good put it down quickly. Let's come back. Okay, let's try something new. No. Let's zoom in. Okay, um, I'm going to get this wrong probably. Q min something aviation group and then the registration. Working up, we have the tail, uh, red, grey, sort of light grey, yellow, and blue. Um, this is the third time out of its box, probably gonna be the longest because it's after this, it's going to go to the air, the main airport. Okay, so just a little information about Asiana Airlines. Um, Asiana Airlines was founded on the 17th of February and commenced operations on the 23rd of February, uh, December, sorry, the same year, and flew flights from, uh, Seoul to Busan with 737 Classics. Uh, it was formerly known as Seoul Air International, and in 1999 the airline began its first international services to Japan and had a fleet consisting of 9 747s, 400s, 10 767 300s, and 8 737 400s. The following year, the airline began to fly to Bangkok, Singapore, Hong Kong, and Taipei, and had trans-Pacific flights to Los Angeles in the USA. Uh, the Los Angeles flights were used with the, the 747 400, and in 1993, Asia began to fly to Ho Chi Minh City. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna fail that one. In Vietnam, during the mid 1990s, the airline began services to Vienna, Brussels, Honolulu, and in Ju January 2003, Asia became a Star Alliance member. In 2004, Asia gained the A330 and 777 to its fleet. In 2012, the airline had net sales around about 5.3 billion US. As of June 2017, the airline had only one A350 and still does because it's June 2017. And is the only current airline to have ordered all three A350 variants. Uh, the A350 variants are the 800, 900, which is this model here, and which they have and 1000. Uh, the 800 it is most likely not going to be made, so it's still going to have all variants. Moving, moving the model to one side, and this one is going to be terrible. Uh, we're going to take a look at the box. It's going to be hard. Uh, yeah, I think I'm up anymore. Uh, so here we have the Asiana logo, 
the A350 Airbus logo as well. Uh, Gemini just look inside box, which is empty. Uh, the model uh, computer generated sort of thing. Gemini Jets logo. Uh, the motto top box, turn around. Uh, logo uh, warning. Uh, price this was 30% off as mentioned in the description barcode which everyone loves uh, price again logo uh, computer generated uh, 1400 scale die cut asked, uh, and then the item number uh, Gemini Jets logo the information so just basic 1400 scale die cost highly collectible superior quality realistic metal landing gear, detailed printed graphics, and as real as it gets features. Uh, back box, just aircraft, logo, pretty much just uh, summing it up, uh, description of the brand, highly collectible, um, and has you know, just basically propaganda, made in China. 2017 Las Vegas, USA. Uh, this was not the place I got from, it was shop and go or something at the airport. So, yeah. Uh, inside of the box, um, here we have the thing. Uh, just basically a description. I'll, the same on the Delta A350 900BS, so go check that out if you can. If you want to, please do. If you need it, please. Um, uh, livery, aircraft type, and just a whole bunch of stuff, length, uh, all that, so, yeah. Overall, I would give this model a 8.5 or 7.5 out of 10 model aircraft, yeah, I'm not gonna take off so many puns, so many puns, but don't hurt me please. Um, but yeah, so it's a nice model, uh, detailed, uh, I can't really talk much more because Tynus helped me, but yeah, so nice model, um, I would recommend it, surprise, there's like no one else uh, with no videos with this model on YouTube. Um, I saw this in Phoenix, I'm pretty sure, as well. Uh, full, about two large boxes of this small aircraft. No one had touched it. So, yeah, that's a bit of a shame. But yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, like, subscribe. Uh, more details of this small are in the description. So, just the Delta description, pretty much. Yeah. And yeah. Thank you and goodbye.